All right, let's stand up. Let's get started while our old hens are coming in. Old roosters, our old roosters. All right, let's stand up. Here we go. Let's stand up. You aggravating my department. All right, here, here we go. Uh, Oh, what a Savior, oh, what a Savior, oh, what a Savior is mine, unto the uttermost, wonderful, glorious, oh, what a Savior. Good to go, fellas. All right, brother Paul, turn me down there. But some of these folks are complaining. <laughs> you know how that goes, man. I ain't heard one complaint. No, some of these people are complaining. Still, that's good right there. You know, the Lord did something to murmurers. You remember, the murmurers couldn't go in the promised land. Isn't that strange, man? Isn't that strange? How you doing, Brother Luke? All right. Let's open up with prayer. Brother Luke, so we can hear you, would you come up to this microphone, brother, and pray so we know when you say amen? Some, some of us don't have the hearing we used to have. The, 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 my doctor says all the shotgun shells going off have affected that. All right. Let's buy and pray, folks. Amen. All right, have a seat there. Uh, we're, we're moving a little behind schedule. Thank you, Brother Kenny. Buddy, you're, you're a good rooster. Amen. <laughs> Hope you don't mind me leaving my tie. Last Sunday morning, I about sweated to death, couldn't breathe. So long as we're outside, I don't perceive me wearing a tie. I don't feel, I, I don't normally preach without one, but I, I, I uh, it's a little warm. But Jim, what are we singing? 131. Hey, man, let's give it a whirl. Let's <laughs> come on up. You up to singing a little? Come try it, come try it. We need a little alto. A little alto. A little alto. <laughs> a little alto. Yeah. 
It's the yellow one. Turn, turn up the yellow one. It's not turned up on the thing over there loud enough. Sherry over there is going to tell you one thing. He's going to tell you something. Brother Rich is going to tell you something. Now, Brother Jack is going to tell you something. So here, you got your mask on. We are not social distancing. <laughs> so, got that part out, brother. <laughs> so the question is, who do you listen to? No, <laughs> absolutely not. I've just been lying to you your whole life. You ignore Mike me. The thing with Mike, he said, if I quit laughing at his jokes, he's gonna have to find a new friend. So I make sure I laugh at his jokes. Just sing, brother Jim. Just sing, brother. Just sing. On the last. On the last. Just one glimpse inside the home game. See the friends and loved ones who wait. Will be worth whatever the cost to make it through and through. I could not give up in the race. I'll continue by the Lord's grace. Ready, white in the blood of the Lamb. 
your garments, spotless are they white as snow, are they washed in the blood of the Lamb? Somebody get me a cup of water. I left my water this morning, and I, I need a, a look at old brother Jeremy. Man. He said, look at him, he's limping, man. He's made so many trips back and forth to that building. Yeah, just, just, hey, brother Jeremy, that refrigerator's got a filter inside. My mom would be fine, too. Yeah, sure. Jeremy, we got one. Hey, I, I want it. They do pick up, but I'll get two more even left. All right, now, who are you looking at? Don't you dare look at my name, son. Stay away from the mics. Don't, don't look, look, don't you look at the mics. All right, you, you look out there at, at, at Miss Susan. Hey, Miss Susan, no, we're not social distancing now. <laughs> Go to Papa. All right, now, I want to tell you this. <laughs> All right, look at that. We got a haircut. Huh? Oh, did you get that? Oh, thank you so much. Boy, thank you, thank you, thank you. I think a little hair good. First, I, I, I want to tell you something, Grace Valley. Um, I appreciate you coming out here and having these services outside. Uh, but this, this wouldn't work in too many churches. In too many churches, they would do this. We've been blessed to be able to do it, but most people, it's just too much outside the norm for them. And so most people are staying home and they're watching, they're watching on Facebook uh, as much as they can probably, but I, I appreciate you coming. I, I, I said uh, some time back, I said, boy, it, 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 it takes uh, special folks to come out here and show up Sunday after Sunday and do this. And I appreciate you doing it. I want you to know as you're a pastor, I, 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 I'm thankful. I'm very thankful. And it means a lot to me. And not all that, it's every week somebody has rolled by and seen us and commented about it. And, and, and it's make, it, it is making a difference for the kingdom of our Lord. Amen. It's making a difference. And I appreciate <coughs> you doing your part. I want you to know that. But don't ever, don't ever think I'm not thankful to you. I am thankful to you, and, and so is the Lord. Miss Faye, there's that priest. Amen. Yes, Brother Jack. We have a friend uh, many years ago. Do you remember him? I do remember Gary. Right on Facebook, that their church in Georgia is being sued for meeting. Oh. And, oh, not his church, a church. Oh, my goodness. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. We do. Amen. 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 Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'll tell you, it is. It is a blessing. Anybody else? Anybody else think it's a blessing to be able to come? Amen. 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 Praise God. I think yes, it's it a is. blessing. Man, I, I'm thankful. But I'm thankful. Thank you, Peter. Thankful to be here. Thankful you believe it's a blessing to come to the house of God. I believe it is. And um, let, let me mention this to you before we sing our next song. Uh, the Lord has been good to us, and God may give us weather like this for the rest of the year. He can. He's in control of the weather. But, but if things go like the Bible says they do, God makes it to rain on the just. On the unjust. That's the word of God. We looked into getting us a tent because, you know, I'm not real safe us get. I don't feel real safe us getting inside our confined building. I'm, I'm not real safe. We have about 20 people on Wednesday night, and we do wear a mask, but we are we are pushing that and all that. And all that. I want other people to feel safe. So we know that being in the open air like this is about the safest place you 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 can get. So we looked into getting a tent. We, we would need we, we would need a we would need a hundred by an eighty. Now this is looking at uh, some other churches that have done that are going outside 
They have pavilions that are 100 by 80 buildings. They can they can social distance and get 200 people in that 80 by 100 building. Now, you can pack people in there and get a lot, but we want to be able to practice that. Well, that, that size of a tent is like $40,000. Can't find a use. That's a lot of money for a tent. When, when we could build a, a covered building that one day we could turn into a a, a, a building. So I want you to pray about us just building a covered building out here. Take a lot. We got to have a contractor. We we can't we can't do it ourselves. So we need somebody that can build a that, that erects buildings like that that has a contractor's license that knows how to go down there and throw fits. Because <laughs> that's what you have to do. So anyway, just be praying about that if you would, and if you know. No, no contractors like that. We, we're going to have to have one. Okay, somebody go to bat for church. Somebody that loves the Lord, a bat for us. Okay, Amen. so be praying Amen. about that. Let's pray, yes, and uh, then we'll sing a, we'll sing another song here. Uh, but Mike Truett, would you would you pray, brother, please? Amen. 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 I'm trying to catch that amen back there. Uh, I got the fan blowing on me on here. So if you see my hand like that, it has nothing to do with my age. It has everything to do with the faith. Let's sing, Brother Jim. 117. Something about Jesus. 117. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Oh, I like it. All right, on the first. Each day I'll do.
prayer of thanksgiving. Father, Lord, God, we want to give you thanks today. Yes. Lord, we have electricity. We have new microphones. We have folks that sing. Lord, we have our musicians back. Amen. And uh, God, Amen. what a miracle. Yes. Upon miracle upon miracle that we've seen you perform. We have another dry Sunday, Lord with the breeze blowing through the trees, how thankful that we are. God, we have a Savior that's died and completely paid our sin debt. And yes, where we can't live right, live for you, he makes it so we can because he comes inside of us, gives us a desire and a will to do that that's right, and we're thankful. God, when we fall and slip and stumble and mess up, we have a God that readily picks us up, holds us up, refreshes, restores, forgives, and gives back more than we ever lost. God, we love you for that. God, we thank you, Lord, for all these many blessings, God, that we look and that we see. God, we've been blessed out here. There are churches, dear God, that are being sued, that have been turned on, Dear God, for worshiping. And God, I pray that you'll give them strength and give them victory in the courts. Make sure, God, their cases go before righteous judges. Yes. God, I want to pray against this socialistic government faction in this country that promotes sodomy, lesbianism, corruption, child molestation, sex trafficking that would tear down the righteousness that our forefathers have built. God, I pray that you divide them, bring them in derision, and laugh at them, dear God, in the day of their derision. And I pray that God in their places for those that will not repent, God, should they repent and come to Christ, that would be the first and foremost thing. But should they not, God, move them on, move them out, and put righteousness in their place, righteous judges, righteous politicians, righteous governors, give us those that love righteousness. We ask this in Jesus' name, and we ask, Father, that you save those that are nearest hell today. For Christ Jesus' sake, we ask, amen. 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 All right, but Jim, what you say we take up our offer? I praise God. All right, get the bucket, brother, if you would. I like that bucket. Amen. Amen. Well, Jim, if you're looking at him, brother Jim, you're looking at him again. <laughs> you looked at him, Jim. <laughs>
loves it when we cheer for him. God likes it. Just that much fun. Take our Bibles this 